Since the introduction of multi-rail power supplies, there is a constant debate, with two well-differentiated sides, supporters of single rail sources against supporters of multiple rail sources. A rail consists of a set of electrical traces that are monitored by the OCP, overcurrent protection, controller of the power supply, joining the internal components of the power supply with the cables. The electrical traces are the copper tracks through which electricity circulates within a component and that can be seen on the PCB of these. The OCP circuit is responsible for monitoring that the voltage in a certain portion of the electrical circuit does not exceed certain parameters and, in case of doing so, it would be in charge of automatically turning off the power supply, to avoid damage to its interior or the equipment it is feeding. The concept of single rail versus multi-rail sources is based on the additional security that multi-rail sources inherently have. And this concept is based on dividing the rail plus 12V, in other multiple rails plus 12V of lower amperage. If the power supply has a single plus 12V rail with a capacity of 100A, the OCP protection can be teared so that it exits when it reaches 150A. By then, most of the components of the system will have died by the overvoltage. If, on the contrary, the source has a plus 12V channel of 100A, but is divided into four rails of 25A, if a short circuit occurs in one of the rails, it will only affect the components that are connected to that channel leaving the rest of the system safe. So, when someone says that the power supplies of a single rail are better than those of several rails, it is equivocato. Neither give a cleaner current, nor have fewer problems of temperature, nor allow better overclocks, or many trifles that are often invented by the manufacturers of the sources. The funniest part of this debate is that many of the power sources of very high power, above 900W, are actually sources with several rails, where the rail for the graphic cards is separated from the rail for the processor, as a precautionary measure, 